Hey guys, how's it going? I'm Justin Davis with Drone Camps RC. We're here with Rich Burton from Hooperfly and we're out on the field. We're gonna do some autonomous swarm testing. We have four drones on the field right in front of us. So you'll see all four of these take off at the same time. They're running a flight controller called Paparazzi. It's a local open source flight controller. Three, two, one, lift off. Okay, there they go. Nice, all four up in the air. And they're all in formation right now. Now GPS is a little bit sketchy. Yeah, one of them sounds like it has an issue on a prop. It sounds like it's hitting something on the aircraft. Oh, it's got a leaf or something stuck to it. But they're all hanging out where they should be. They're hanging out in formation. It's like a, a contrail in the background. And these are all controlled on 900 megahertz. Four different signals coming out, but running from the same ground station using paparazzi and GPS positioning. Pretty cool. All of them are seem to be doing pretty well. We had one earlier acting up. It was doing a little bit of toilet bowling, so obviously needed some calibration. If you see your drone start to toilet bowl, it needs calibration or you're just getting a bad GPS signal. But right now, this is all looking pretty good. Drone camps and Hooper fly with the paparazzi flight controller. Pretty cool stuff. A lot of people out there. These are all flying autonomously. There is no controller involved in this flight. It's completely autonomous. Okay, so Rich said we're gonna come down and land. Three, two, one, here they come. And they're all safely back on the ground. All right, nobody's privacy was violated in that demonstration. I wanna know what's in that motor. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Justin Davis from Drone Camps RC. Please click subscribe.